Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know, and it is time for some more of the long run where we are playing CrossCode. So, the last time we uh, got through Fyro Temple, we also made a new friend, uh, our buddy Toby here. And uh, we got our next uh, shade which will allow us access once I remember all the buttons, which I never will, clearly. It will allow us access to here, the next area of the game, Autumn's Fall. Let's see. Also, I forget if we had gotten the thing yet. Now we only have the cor the core drill so far. I think I might have said that I was going to off screen getting some materials for the uh, for the next thing, but I clearly didn't because I'm terrible like that. So oh well. Plenty of time to get that stuff. For now, let's just do the thing right away. Uh, did I talk to these guys? Well, I did now. Uh, Sticky or Psyche? Oh, Psyche Atric, gotcha. Psyche Atric. Leah Smug. Yes, indeed. Welcome to Let's Play the World. We are here in Autumn's Fall, where there's going to be a lot more platforming puzzles. Because, well, I mean, after all, this is cross code to play here. Also, I pressed the wrong button. Uh, I need to press this. Level 32. The hedgehogs have a turn sharper and, every and edgier than ever. Whoops. So why would they do this? They can perfectly find a uh, marine creature and crossing with a fly or a mosquito? I don't know. I mean, it's cross code. Does anything need to really make sense? Eat the cow. The level is the cow. 36. I think we can wait to beat the cow. This guy's level 35. No seahorse is shooting exactly anyway. Water bubbles? Where did they get that excess water from? You never see him in the water. Toby, I think you're overthinking it. I uh, think this goes here. That looks like a good place to put that. As much as I am proven wrong. I haven't seen really any places to climb yet. Nope. That's not it. Here we go. 
Maybe so, uh, there really is a lot more water here compared to Hutchins Rise. I suppose they wanted to raise the difficulty. Remember everyone, water is deadly. Finding any places to climb, and it's kind of bothering me a little bit. There we go. That's not a place to climb! Eh. Yeah, no showering in this game. Although, you know, we're made of instant matter, so it's not like we're stinky. Okay, just got completely annihilated there. I'm not really sure what happened. That's not what I wanted to do, game. Yeah. Oh, do I not have a demo shark for a uh, for... Is that what's going on? Okay. Obviously, these things pose much more of a threat than I thought they would. Talk about the seahorses again. Did you notice they sound like actual horses? Seahorses are not related to horses. I repeat, not related. They just look them, whatever that's it. Toby, calm down. Your journey has taken you across these times of prosperity long past. Taking your next destination in the wilderness to the north, you must first accomplish the trial of these fields. Pursue the path of the luminous creature, and prove your mastery of the elements acquired. Traveler, envoy of change, will you accept this trial? I mean, not like, uh, not like I really have a choice. Let your every step form the path of your growth. How does who look similar? Here comes the bunny, that annoying bastard. Hush, Emily, don't spoil it. No spoiler, just look at him jumping away. We all know he's gonna be annoying. You know what? I'm still exploring here. Oh, I guess there's not much to explore in this direction anyway. Alright. I see we're back in the ancient ruins of Puzzle Village. Still serving puzzles even thousands of years later. Still enjoy how much of a dork Emily is. King's ring, and that's a gold item.
There we go. Oh, okay. Okay, that's not what I need to do. This, however, is exactly what I need to do. I mean, you also have the, the option of increasing your volume. I actually cannot increase my microphone volume. Like, literally the only thing that I can do is bring it a little bit closer. over here though. Say hello to the hardest puzzle of the playground. Huh? Isn't that one quite trivial? Sarcasm, Tony. What's over here? Oh, okay. So that's only gonna stay open for, yeah, for a short amount of time. God dang it, guys. Oh, okay. I guess I can just hit it again. There we go. And we get four shrimp risotto. And again, water in a cave, below a lake, we're literally below a gigantic lake. So, there's just no way you can make this work. Just imagine the water pressure. Who cares, it's just a game. We're on an actual moon here, physics still apply. Nerd. Oops. Okay, this this was an ambush. Cool. Come on. Charge up, buddy. I know you want to. There you go. there? Oh, there it is. Oh, even more of them. Ha! Even with that unintentional bang. What? Yes. Nerd. Yeah, these guys are not joking around.
Thank you, Emily. And what do we get for our troubles? A tremor engine. Gold item. More water. Is this water even real? Maybe it's all virtual. It's pretty real to me. Well, the augmented reality tech they're using is pretty advanced, so it's hard to tell. It would allow them to break physics as they play you. As you scientists, I propose we do an experiment. We kick you into the water repeatedly. Just to make sure it's real. That... that wouldn't even confirm anything. Maybe, but wouldn't it be fun? <laughs> oh, okay. I have to go this way. I have to go this way, but faster. Bank it like that, I think. Yeah, there we go. Pushed again. Of course. Because why wouldn't we? Oh geez. I need a sandwich. And pro possibly some uh, augmentation here. Shot thing is dead? I don't think it is. Humming Razor. Hmm. Man, we are losing a lot of things with this. But our equipment is kind of way low level right now. Average level of 27, that's not gonna cut it. No wonder we're dying. Complex cave full of stalactites everywhere. I feel like there's probably something we can climb onto here. Yeah, here we go. Cold platter. 
Okay, so how do we get out of here? Oh, this works. Came all this way just to have our access denied. Well, computer says no. Um, okay, stop pressing the wrong buttons for a second, will you? Get out of my way, Hedgehog. The return of the Lady Bridge. Yeah, if it's just a cow. Let's give it a try. Wee wee, they brought back the cows. Still feeling bad for punching them. to our AFK. Wonder what they're doing. Uh, where'd that stupid rabbit go? Laser bridge reloaded. Go this way. Hmm. Where is the rabbit? Oh, hi. Okay, how do I get up there? Well, this is now. Of course, I'm going to continue to take all kinds of alternate paths here, because sometimes there's treasure. You know? Treasure's good. It's your deal. And I 
I sure wish I could jump around like that. Did that make exploration too easy? I guess, but how much fun would it be? Well, at least we can do our regular small jumps, right? We regu regular jumping whenever we want, it's at least something. <laughs> ah! Break that. Not that that solves anything, but it might later. I was right about putting the box there. Huh? Something about the old war. Hi! What's up? You want to know about the old war too? It's a pretty dark time in human history. Various colonies waged war against each other. They taught us resources. Uh, they taught us resources were the trigger, but I heard other stories too. Ah, don't worry. It's all in the past now, like a thousand years past. Interesting. Stupid Robert seems to be an Eastern exit now. Old war is old. The annoying rodent now went north of Eastern Egg, but go after it. Oh, you've unlocked a, uh, a land. this sunset claw level 38 we lose boldine scope but get avenger and brawler yeah i think that's a good trade-off Destroying all the plant life for science. a bridge. I'm reading this as put this over here. this over here. Now provided we can get our way up there, which we do.
a treasure. Three green risotto. Anything else over here? Oh, huh. all ruins surrounded by cliffs. So then you really need a neat place to chill out far away from all the troubles of the world. And four rapples. We found about everything in this room. And now how do we leave? Oh, okay. I was high enough to get over that. Oops. Much food. Go catch up with that jumping bastard around Great Lake. Good. Oh, we've analyzed one plant. This doesn't look like an ambush at all. Yeah, I thought so. Another ambush. Oh, this time complete with cow. And also death. Ow. Complete with cow and ow. Didn't believe it. Also, it starts us back here, which I appreciate. So we don't have to do that, to do that first fight over again. Of course, it doesn't help if I keep jumping in the water like an idiot. just have to deal with the big one. I mean, the, the thing is, Jewel, like, even with, uh, even with Chatty, which does support BTTV, I still don't see her emotes. So I, like, yeah, I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, okay. So I need to pull this. Hmm. I'm not going to be able to make that jump. Oh, there's one here. This, I imagine. Put it in the right place. It's gonna be a test of jumping. Let's see if we can make that. Dang it! Is 
with a very precision jump to make. There we go. Another ambush area. And now we have this little shortcut. Oh. That pad is not activated, so we actually have to go the long way around to our next ambush. And also stop by another ambush along the way, apparently. Well. Oh no, have I been clipped again? Trying to perfect guard, but it's not working. There we go. I don't have a throw art for fire, apparently. Oh, I disagree, game. Okay, took me two, two high sandwiches to get that, which, not thrilled about that. And now we have another ambush to deal with. Oh, three cows, okay. It's like that old uh, software website. You know, two cows, except there are three of them. Oh jeez, I, I realize I'm kind of dating myself by mentioning two cows. <laughs> but it's okay, no one else dates me. Hey! coming up that's less than ideal wait what did I aggro I have no idea slant really is shaped in the most implausible and inconvenient way possible isn't it you said that before already, stop nagging. Keeping in mind that these two have already done this quest. can't push this any farther because there we go. Hmm. I wonder why this is a thing. Probably did that for a reason, right?
Whoops. Well, good thing we just unlocked that shortcut. Hey, there we go. That shortcut. And then what? Ah. Alright, you better get ready, Leah. Emily, no spoilers. Oh, come on, it's so clear that this is the final stage. Oh, so we we actually did have to, yeah, because that uh, that jump pad is uh, is not open, so we actually had to do all that. That's cool. Traveler, our little journey is almost over. Now for your last trial, I want you to show me your mastery of the temperatures. <laughs> Oh, right. Let's uh, cool down a little bit here. Okay. That that that's a thing that just happened. Sure. Yes, yes. Just slightly, yeah. Ah, crap, I elemental overloaded. That's not good. That means I have to wait for my elemental charge to get down to the bottom before I can, uh... Ow. Okay, this again. I don't really know how to deal with this. Dip. Emily, please. Okay, what? How do I... Like, I do not remember this at all. through the windows. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Okay, turn off elemental. It's going to charge whoever it's chasing, but right now it's going to charge Emily. Ow. 
pretty much aggroed on Emily as a thing. Okay, so now this. So basically the same thing except fire, so we gotta attack with ice. Oh my goodness. And just Don Maku Salvo. Proven your proficiency. You passed the trial. Seek your reward from where it began. We got it! Nice work. I'm still annoyed they didn't make it explode. Aren't you a bit cruel? They made us chase that thing for so long that at least they could use give us a proper bunny explosion. That is cute! Bunny explosion. Making Uncle Elmer fun proud. Indeed, Tyrion. How you doing tonight? Oops. Yeah, I can't make any jumps from there. Playing new Pokemon. How's that working out? Arceus thing. Hmm. Can't make that jump, can I? No. Alright. The open world thing of just randomly wandering most of the. I mean, this is this is basically how I play this game, so I mean, you're in the right place. Now, right, let's go talk to the statue. change. You have mastered the trial of these fields. I will bestow upon you the shade to open the passage to the north. Let your every step form the path be rough. The green seed shade. Congratulations, Seeker. You acquire the green seed shade, giving you access to the guy to Gary's Garden to the north. It is, a, it is an expansive jungle and home of several, several temples. The Zervatar Temple, housing the element Shock, and the Stonaji's Temple, housing the element Wayu. Your next task is to acquire both of these elements, and and complete the final trial of the Grand Priscaya. Good luck, and stay vigilant. You got the shade? Alright! Nice! That means we're all set for the raid. But before that, there's one thing I- there's one thing I wanted to tell you. You heard what the geese are said in space, right? With this new shade, you can now enter Gaia's garden. Well, that area is supposed to be a jungle. Ooh. You know what you usually find in jungles? Insects. Like bugs. <laughs> really don't want to go there by myself. Oh, wow. Um, it would be great if you could wait for me so we can enter the jungle together, Dakal. Merci, you're the best. But let's wait on that until after the raid is over, alright? Sounds good. Oh, and now that we're all ready, we should meet up at, at the First Scholar's HQ. Then wanted to give us a small briefing about the raid and explain all the details. Let's go! 
Alright. Sounds like a plan. Let's see. Uh, I didn't open the clock. I should probably do that. Give me just a second here. There we go. So I can actually take my break on time. I'm analyzing another plant. Precision shot, apparently. See, that's the one nice thing about playing with keyboard and mouse. That shots like this can be a lot more precise. There we go. Cheese spectral. Hey, it's tall too. Hello, yeah, darling. Hey. Not a dress a spell here after that awful cold and heat. Feels mighty familiar, to be honest. Uh-huh, the exploring coming along. Doing good so far? Think so. Good to hear. Y'all keep it up now. One of those games you certainly prefer control. I mean, in general, I prefer controller as well. It's just something um, work better with a little bit more precision that the mouse would offer. But general battle like this, you definitely want to be playing with uh, with a controller. Take another one of those hits. There we go. Oh, we leveled up. Really, I think we did pretty much most of the thing from these six screens here. We're not going to be able to progress very far beyond that uh, for a little bit. I think. This area here is blocked by a shade. Yeah. And then if we try to go to the north, uh, Emily is just gonna say like, wait a minute, we should go to uh, to the Guild HQ. So that's kind of our move here. Also, just to have it on the map. Um, this, by the way is the headquarters of the biggest guild in the game, uh, the Last Minute Hero. And the story goes that um, these th this is basically the guild that um, represents the, back the Kickstarter backers of this game. Uh, their story is that whenever they're needed, they'll be there at the last minute. Everyone that arrives too early is automatically disqualified. They were called the last of the heroes for a reason. And uh, the joint heads of this guild are these two people who I actually kinda know. Let's see if we can uh, break into their conversation here now. Uh, but this is... The, the one on the right here is Warbin and Ixel, and this is Puella. And um, they are, if I'm not mistaken, the top backers for this game. Now, the, these are real, like, these are characters based on real backers. But uh, both of them are 
at least kind of active in the Megazoops community. Leah dear, it's so good. it's great to see you again. Just in time for the raid. I suppose the others told you about it already? Mm -hmm. I was planning to, to hold a small briefing today to, to, to explain all the details to you. You have the time right now? Yeah, sure. Alrighty, follow me then. Attention everyone! Tomorrow we'll have our first raid with all first Scholar members. Well... Ah uh, yes, except for Al. Sorry, I'll be on for guard. Anyway, that means we'll, we'll be six people in total. This is perfect because for this raid we'll be split into two teams of three people each. Mid-level team with Leah, Emily, and Trani. And the high-level team with Lucas, Buggy, and me. The raid is balanced, balanced to match the average level of each team, so this will work just fine as part of level difference. Nice. So we can still fight together after all? Sorry, dear, not directly. Both teams will be running on separate tracks running next to each other. Trust me, it's better it's better that you don't want to, to you don't want to be too close to an aggressive level 60 enemy. Why not? I'm sure I could I handle it. Oh, I'd like to see that. Luke, you should swap places with, uh, with Emily. Hush, everyone. Let's not derail too much already. Yes, ma'am. We might be on separate tracks, but there's still a collaboration between the two teams. It's those pillar enemies, right? That's correct. Essentially, both teams have to attack the right targets at the same time. Oh, that sounds interesting. How does it work exactly? No, oh, Trani, don't worry too much about it yet. Quite simple. We'll give you instructions when we're there. Got it. Also be aware that there will be a tricky boss enemy at the end for each team. Make sure to be well prepared, eh? Me, of course. So when do we start? Our slot is reserved for tomorrow afternoon in game time. Make sure you're not too late. Also the entrance to, to the raid area is within Autumn's Fault close to the statue. So let's just meet at the statue tomorrow. Alright, sounds good. I'm so excited. Oh dear. Uh, she is so excited she exploded. <laughs> Look at that! Emily was so excited she burst! Why? Uh, don't worry, dear. Just a small connection error. It happens occasionally. Huh? So they still have connection errors these days? It's not a connection error, strictly speaking. It's one of the avatar servers failing. Crossworlds is run by a huge distributed system. There are hundreds of servers just for the avatars. So it's not unknown that some of them occasionally fail. The backup should be up in a few seconds. Oh, I see. The tech nerd strikes again. Oh, please mind the immersion. Right, my apologies. Suck, what was that? Don't worry, dear, just a small technical issue. I see. Oh, actually, I was planning to log off soon anyway. Still gotta get some stuff done, so I have all the time tomorrow for the raid. Yeah, same for me, actually. Ronnie, Leah, let's meet tomorrow and go to the raid together. Please keep K Fava. <laughs> make sure to be there on time. We still might want to prepare a bit. Okie dokie. Well then, see you tomorrow. Au revoir. Bye. Bye, everyone. What about you, Leah? Logging off, uh, logging off as well? Might be a good idea. I will take. I will make sure you get to get you back into the game in time. All right then. See you tomorrow. Goodbye, my dear. Bye.
Sorry, nothing seems to work. She still doesn't respond. Is she entirely unconscious? I'm not sure. It's possible that she still perceives her surroundings. I see. I'm very sorry. I tried everything. I honestly have never encountered an issue like this. It's possible that her past experiences have led to this. That's why there's one last thing we can try. We can make her forget. Good morning, Leia. Doing fine? I made sure to log you in early, so there's still plenty of time before the raid. Is everything okay? Wait, did you have another dream? What did you see? Why? Hmm. Was it that one location again? A person? Uh, another location? Why? Now I am somewhat puzzled. What else could you have remembered? Actually, about the dream you had before this. I read a couple of questions that could help us pinpoint the location you saw. Alright, let me see. Did it look like a jungle with lots of plants, huge trees, etc.? No? Alright, I suppose it would not be Guy's garden then. Okay. Is it a fairly dark location with bamboo trees and similar plants? Yeah, that sounds right. It's these. It must be Sapphire Ridge then. That's one of the loca the later locations of Roswell. It is still a ways off, but we will reach it eventually. Once, you once you're there, maybe it will help you to recover your memory. Well then, let's continue with today's schedule. In other words, let us prepare for the raid! I think the guild wanted to meet at the statue in Adam's Fall, right? Sounds like a plan. Let's see. You might want to stock up on sandwiches first. Yeah, please. Hey man, what'd you like? Uh, let's top off with nine of these. So that will give us ten total. I think I'm good. Just wanted to uh, restock on curatives. Let's see. The statue was uh, the ruined path, right? I do have plenty of money, but uh, keep in mind that some of the trade items are very expensive. Which, speaking of which, we should probably look into that. Because otherwise we might be a little bit outmatched for that, uh, for that raid. As you notice here, we still have a level 25 helmet. Apparently, you have a new quest. I'll do that eventually. <laughs> okay. There's Contour, there's the High Ward. Sure, I'm totally able to convey sentiments. That is the thing that I can do. I mean, I'm going to the, the trader's contour, but I'm not gonna do. Wait. This place sells sandwiches too?
Yeah, it's all of the... It's all of buff items. So whatever we get, we would lose trainer probably. Close to this, we need three headphone scraps. I uh, wish we can get a rookie loot and play the trader. A rookie loot. Probably one of you. There we go. Headphone scraps. See, that costs us thirty-six thousand. Um, and upgrading torso or legs would be good. We can do both, and great. Side. We need two more chef sandwiches, and I'm not really sure where to obtain those. Uh, and it's not telling us. That's great. It'll tell us for any trade item, but chef sandwiches are not a trade item is the problem. Beat up a chef, a chef. I don't think the game will let us do that. We'll deal with that quest when we have a, an actual party going on. Yeah, one of these places sells wolf cicadas. You also need refined metal and old bones. I think it was inside. I if we needed three or four. Oh, we needed three. Uh, refined metal and old bones. So one refined metal, five old bones. We can get refined metal here. Uh, Bergen Village Trader's Den. Bergen Village. I just need one.
Oh, we can get chef sandwiches here. We need fruit sets. Uh, we have veggie sets. That's actually all we needed. Um, now let's get a couple more junk metals, just in case. Yeah, that's all we needed for one of the items. The chef is spared for now. But we might be able to upgrade both pieces now. Um, no, that's not what I was looking at. I seem to recall we were just a couple of chef sandwiches. We can get a, a chef sandwich here. Cool. Alright. So many traders. Oh, this is an upgrade to something we have equipped now. Interesting. All right. That automatically unequips it. But I mean, we can just equip the upgraded piece, which should be a direct upgrade. And that's the thing. Like, there, there's a lot of... Um, there's a lot of trades that involve upgrading equipment that you already have. I find that kind of fascinating. Um, we need five old bones. Um, can we get old bones from traders at all? No. We can only get them from Maroon Valley. All right. Not interested in fighting right now. Good. Get if there are any other places where I can um, get old bones. And I aggroed them again. Which, whatever. Not fighting without my, my buds. Not unless I have to, anyway. I was hoping that uh, re-warping to this area would actually respawn everything, but no. Yeah, some bones over here. Hmm. I think this gives us botanist, right? Yeah. Right now that's 
That's what we need. We're in a lower level area, so... We don't need the protection as much. But we do need to increase... Uh, drop rates from these bone piles. We got one. Hey, we can get that, uh, that chest now. Two. Three. Four. Turns out, turns out putting on that hat was a good idea. Also, we can get that chest over there. The re lucid shards, which we've been getting from these bone piles anyway. And there we go. I do a bean. Uh, let's see. Oops. And that'll let us upgrade our last. Um, piece of lagging behind here. The stable foot guard. Which unfortunately we lose our HP regen, but uh there we go. We are now poor. We're down to twelve thousand credits. So we're level 34 with level 37 gear. A little imbalanced, but uh, at least it's imbalanced in our favor. I do appreciate the little kind of tap 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 as the you run across the laser bridge. Very subtle, but it's there. Others already, uh, already went ahead to the raid area. All we have to do is wander through this cave here, which I could have done later on. Like at this point, when we actually have the shade. Blah. We still have some time left, though. We should make sure we're well prepared. I wouldn't mind checking out equi equipment options in Rookie Harbor one last time. Don't be such a worry, Wartroni. I'm ready to kick them down here right now. Thanks, Jokalia. I guess we could have picked up the guy before uh, doing our little, our own little shopping thing. But let's check out their equipment. It's a bit slim. Not gonna lie. But all we should need to do is bring them to the marketplace. Uh, 
on the day upgrade? No, they did not. Wait, hold up. What, what am I doing? Does the one have a tail? It, it looks like a tail. It's just her hairstyle. Got new gear. Now I wonder how these edges and triggers are supposed to improve my magic. There we go. They've both upgraded a little bit. Alright, let's head off to the um, raid location. actually closer to go over here. I think we have time for the raid before break. We can just kind of rush through this at this point, because we've already gotten all of the items. Um, I was just wondering if there was a way to cross over there, but there doesn't appear to be. There might be a way to cross back of that way. Oops. Get out of my way. If I wanted to... Yeah, we can go back this way. We just can't go forward this way. And yes, the entire point of this, uh, this area here is that it is the um the raid location we just didn't have the shade so we weren't able to actually get here before we talk to the guys see if there are some treasures that we can get oops How did you guys get over there? Oops. Um. Brian and Shrek. And where is Apollo when you need him? Fortunately, the the, um, the guildmates are just gonna let us run around here. They cool like that. Sure can't. How do we get over there? Dang.
Hmm. Also, invisible walls. Is definitely a thing in MMOs. Eh, alright. We can come back here later. I mean, we're always gonna have access to this place. Hi! Leah, dear. It looks like everyone is assembled for the raid. I hope you're all well prepared. There are a lot of battles ahead of us. So how about it? Are you ready for the raid? I sure am. Alrighty, then let's get started. And all set. We're ready to start. Welcome everyone to Para Island, an important milestone of the track. They say that in old times the ancients used these grounds to test for, uh, for a test of teamwork. And now it's up to us secrets to prove that the to prove to the ancients that we're no long, we're no strangers to teamwork as well. They say a great reward awaits those uh, that reach the top of the hill on this island. However, the top shall only shall only be reached when two teams move in unison. The first team is sitting on the left will be the newcomers of the first scholars, Leah, Emily, and Citron. Hell yeah. The second team is sitting on the right will be us old timers, Schneider, Buggy, and me. Old timer, huh? I definitely don't get that a lot. Well, you got the matching hairstyle. <laughs> so true. Please, everyone, focus. Now, reaching the top of this hill is quite the challenging endeavor indeed. There will be many foes and obstacles that will put our teamwork to the test. Our attacks will have to be coordinated, that's why communication is key. Wait. Don't worry, Leah, I didn't forget about you. In fact, I think I have the perfect role for you. See, one member of each team will be the column tackler, and I think you're a good choice for this. It'll be your task to attack specific enemies during the raid. Ronnie and Emily will support you and keep communication with us going. Does everyone agree with this? Sounds good. Yes, sounds good to me. Daka, as long as there's stuff left for me to punch. <laughs> Alrighty, I'll give you more instructions during the raid. Just keep your heads up, eh? Of course. So hold me the column tackler in our team. Can I be it please? Please, please, please. Alright, Raphael, but please be mindful and don't forget about the teamwork. Of course, ma'am. Is everyone ready? Ready! Yep! Yes, ma'am! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Alrighty, everyone get in front of your track. Column tacklers, please step on those marks on the ground. Time for some good music. It chags, really, that's it. That's just a warm up. Stay on your guard. We oui, oui, keep them coming. Great, give me some new stuff to punch. Come on, give us some time, Emily. Here we go. Now we're talking. 
Hey everyone over here! We now have to fight the pillars. Now it's time for the column tacklers to act. Basically, we have to fight the small blocks with the same color. Let's start with the red blocks. We have buggy, only attack those. Once the blocks are activated, everyone can help bring them down. Okay, so we got that one. Red blocks defeated on our side. Alrighty, let's tackle the remaining blue blocks. Actum! The pillar will now attack with the heavy caliber. Blue's, obl Blue's obliterated. And done! Nice! Into the next stage, everyone! Oh, jeez. Fifth pillar. Let's fight the blue block first this time. We punch the blue blocks. Blue's obliterated. Alrighty, time to take those red blocks now. Oops. Red blocks defeated on our side. Nice work, everyone, and onward. Look at this, the new color. Let's beat the purple blocks first. I want to get rid of those annoying sea horses first. Whoa, what are those attacks? I think those are shock attacks. Better be careful. already taken care of their purple. Sandwich up here. You have all the remaining blocks now. Uh, okay, so they're only purple and red. I thought there was purple, red, and blue. Um... Guys, cover me. Guys, cover me better. Oh, crap. There we go. Drop the ball, the ball on that one a little bit. Good riddance. Next round, let's focus on the blue blocks first. Wait, I already hit a green block. Raphael, don't be so rash. Okay, let's focus on green blocks.
There we go. Oh, geez. Okay, breaking them again is a bad idea. Where am I? Yeah, I lost myself that time. Like, there, there was too much happening all in the small space. And I could not follow where I was. So Lin calls blue. Raph hits green. Lin calls green. I need to hit the other blue thing. There we go. There we go. Okay. We good. We good. And we level up. everyone we're doing quite well there's just one more pillar pillar battle in that cave over there and then it's time uh, to face the boss everyone ready we oui, I know Z wait what something's going on that was creepy to be the last pillar enemy we'll let you decide which element to attack this time So yes, for this one we get to pick. Cool delicious ice. It's too you got to keep that craving for ice cream under control. Tap the purple blocks now, the shock blocks. It's a shocking turn of events. We almost got it! Greenish blocks now. Nope. No pun. I got nothing. What's this thing? element anyway? A wave, and honestly nobody knows quite what it is. Like an element of peace and good vibrations. Let's smash it, everyone! The element of peace is no more. So that's all the pillars, then. <laughs> that's odd. Never mind, I must be imagining things. Here we are, attempt at the final stage. Everyone ready? Very much. Hmm? Wait. Something's not right here. Uh, what happened? Mia uh, is gone? Is, is this some kind of bug? Damn it! Why now of all times? Uh, where are we? No, why? Yeah, someone has interfered. Someone hacked the environment server and managed to drag you out of the raid. Right when you teleported. There was signs of someone tampering with the system shortly before it happened. But it was too late for me to react. 
Looks like we're looks like we're somewhere close to Burn Trail. Or this place is pretty much isolated. No connection with the official playground. You're trapped. Why? I have no idea who did it or why. But they likely have a reason to bring to bring you to this place. So just we have a look around and see what happens. Please be careful. Teleportation and healing all seem to be blocked. They've been very thorough. <laughs> Finally, we meet again. What an enjoyable sight. Like a little bird once caged, now flying around freely. Why? The little bird became rather talkative, didn't it? How? Never thought. As much as you might enjoy your freedom, you should be aware that you don't belong in this place. Why? So you're still clueless. Very peculiar. It matters not. We are here to take to take you with us once again. And with no more uh, with no interference by pesky mortals this time around. Now there is certainly no reason to rush. Let us not forget the purpose of this realm. People gather in this place by the thousands. Why do you think that is? Because they seek the experience. The experience of reading the situation, predicting the patterns, and finding the weak spot. The the experience, the challenge, and we abide with it, this experience. Our very existence is dedicated to this, to this experience. Well, that was to demonstrate. Oh dear. Wingard. <laughs> Never forgot. Let's start with simple heat and cold, the elements of your own. Okay, Leah. We now we now understand who interfered. I will try to, I will try my best to get control of this situation. You need to give me as much time as possible. Please play along with him and keep him busy. Good. Now then, how will you fare with the other two elements? Ow. a bit further. Why were you blocking that? I see.
Oh, okay. is we don't have a whole lot of time to uh to rest here. Um so this fire is missing. We need to hit with ice. Was that all? How very disappointing. The experience is now over. The bond struggle and the challenge to create, a challenge to master it. What follows is the impossible. And the impossible is trivial. Prepare for a sequence of bottomless difficulty. One more hit and the struggle is over. Attack number one. Attack number two. three. Yeah, when do we get a... Oh, okay. You've been captured at last. We will now send you to where you belong. That was a short dream. Yeah. Also, hi, Zero. Hope you're doing well tonight. I didn't notice you come in at the at the top of the raid there. I apologize for that. You have the same color name as Lortarian, and uh, it was hard to, to keep up during the raid. Hmm. Yeah. Are you all right? Can you still hear me? Okay. You were suddenly kicked from the game right after that fight. I was I was unable to get you back online for several hours. It seems to be working again, finally. But what is this place? Wait. Hmm? What is it? Wait. Oh, do you remember this place? Did you see it in your dreams? I see, so you must have been here before. I'll just have a look around, okay? Let me just have a drink here. Vermilion Wasteland. Definitely somewhere we haven't been before. To the gun garden? Certainly did not see this anywhere else in the playground. The avatars would just mess it up in a heartbeat. Who are you? Gotham? Is that you? Hello. Long time no see. Hi. So you started talking. Your vocabulary seems fairly, fairly limited now. Because who exactly put you back into the game anyway? You're not supposed to be around anymore. Why? Still don't remember now. What about this room? Does that at least look familiar? I see. So your memory might return sooner or later. That's worrisome. 
Why? And better not tell you too much. Anyway, we have a little something for you to do. Just wait a moment, please. Gotham. What exactly are you doing here? I don't know. You don't remember Gotham? He used to be an old colleague of mine, and then went missing several years ago. Why? I do not know. Alright, Leah, can you hear me? Please step outside and exit the corridor to the west, then south. Somebody you know will be waiting outside. Yeah, we should do as he says. I will tell you more about Gotham soon. For now, I'll just try to figure out exactly where we are. I mean, we're in Vermilion Wasteland, we've established that. But, what is Vermilion Wasteland? Oh, we shall find out more about that. After the break. So, things happened. Um, more importantly, what about my raid reward? Things happened, and um, so we're we basically got kidnapped, and we don't know where we are other than Vermilion Wasteland. Um, what does that mean for us? Hard to say right now. But after the break, about ten fifteen minutes. We shall um, go out the west and then south and see what happens and see who we can meet there. So I'll see you then.